Hello guys, welcome back with another video on our channel Learn with Gigs. In today's video, we'll discuss what is the real Power BI salaries that companies offer to different people in India and what is the actual scenario in 2022. Okay, and whatever numbers I will display in front of you, these all are authentic numbers. I have seen people getting those numbers in their offer letter. Obviously, I can't disclose their offer letters in front of you all because it is something confidential. So you can believe on these numbers and basically after watching this video, you will get a fair idea and also the motivation to include Power BI in your skill set. Or if you are already knowing this Power BI tool, then to become an expert in this tool so that it helps you to earn more and progress in your career. Okay, so let's start with this session and please watch the complete video and share this video to everyone who are not interested in coding part and still want to excel and earn more in their professional life. Okay, okay, so let's start first with the trend. So as you can see in 2022 and 2023, the opportunities or the vacancies for Power BI developers will increase by 5 to 10 percent. And this percentage is predicted by the experts in data and analytics domain. Okay. And with the trend in the market, this numbers are authentic also. Okay. So the opportunities for freshers or anyone will increase as a power bay develop as a power bay developer by 5 to 10 percent by this year okay going further by 2024 and 25 the opportunities will increase by 15 to 30 percent and with 2026 and 2027 the opportunities or the vacancies will increase by 40 to 50 percent as you can see the demand for power bay developers is increasing at an exponential rate in the coming years okay so this is what we have in the trend section so, so basically if you're looking for job in power bi okay or if you're thinking to include this in your skill set then it is the then it has a very bright future for you in the coming years okay so now let us come to the salary part for the freshers so if you are a fresher, so first of all, I am not considering the people who are from top IITs and NITs. I am only considering the people who are from the majority of the colleges in India. Okay, so the minimum salary as a fresher that companies are offering is 2.4 lakhs per annum. I know this number is very small, but this is the hard reality and bitter truth that freshers are getting even this much of salary also. Even companies are offering less than this number also. So if you are a fresher and you are being offered something less than 2.40 LBA, then directly say no to that company. Okay. And the maximum salary that a fresher can expect is 4.20 lakhs per annum. Which are those companies which are offering this much of salary to a fresher? These are all analytics based company. These are all most of them are startups which are basically focused on data and analytics and this is the salary that is being offered by different service based companies. Okay, so this is what I can say that the service based companies are offering a minimum salary of 2.40 LPA and the analytics based company are offering a maximum salary of 4.2 LPA. So if you are a fresher, you should target on these startups or on only on the analytics based company, then only you will get a decent salary in India as a fresher in Power BI role. Okay, now let's move ahead with two to four years of experience range. So for two to four years of experience range, if you are a Power BI developer, then prerequisite is that you should also know SQL. Okay, so SQL is required as a Power BI developer if you are coming in two to four years of experience range. So the minimum salary that is being offered for this range is 5.4 LPA. And most of the time, these are the service based companies which are offering you this much of salary. But if I talk about the maximum salary range in this experience is 11 LPA, okay, 11 lakhs per annum. And now which are those companies which who are offering this much of salary? So those include big four firms, those includes uh, a well established uh, analytics firms. I will not take name of any firm, but you have, but you can get a fair idea which are those companies who can offer you this much of salary in this experience range. Okay, so you can easily target those companies. But yes, this is what you get in this experience range. Generally, obviously exceptions are always there. 
So minimum salary is 5.4 LPA and the maximum salary is 11 LPA in this experience range. Now let's move to the four to six years experience range and see what is the salary range. So if you are having relevant experience of four to six years, so the minimum salary that you can expect is 13 lakhs per annum. Okay, that you can see here. 13 lakhs per annum is the minimum salary that you are being offered as a Power BI developer and the maximum salary that you can expect from different big companies is 22 lakhs per annum. Okay, I have recently seen a person who has switched to a different company and he is getting this much of lakhs per annum as a Power BI developer. Okay, so, so as you have seen the complete video, you might have noticed that as your experience is increasing, the more you are being offered in Power BI. Okay, so keep this in mind. If you are a fresher and give some time to yourself, have some experience and then try to switch to some different company because as your relevant experience increases from zero to six years, your salary can reach up to 22 lakhs per annum also. Okay, and this is the real salary that I am being sharing with you all. So this is what I can say through this video that include this in your skill set and you have a great potential to earn more in the coming time. Okay, so that's it from this video. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe to this channel because I will keep uploading such valuable videos for you all in the coming time. Thank you.